Um, okay, so, uh, yeah, I get it's nice right now. Not too bad, little sun, but that's going to fade. It, it, you eventually. know what? We have a little sun, a few sprinkles. It's okay. kind of a good day to maybe have a pretzel. One yeah. of those, it's a comfort it's food a day. It's a comfort food day, and yeah. And we're going to see a lot of those over the next five or oh. six you, I heard you say this rain and rain and more rain. I'm like, oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. there's buckets. Buckets of rain. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take a look at uh, what is going on across our fair city. We do have clouds in place. Yep. We are going to deal with mainly gray skies, but we will see a few little peaks of sunshine here and there throughout the day. Right now, we're looking at 53 degrees, and we have winds are out of southeast to seven. We'll climb about another 10 degrees today. Still, that is below average. Now, this is our next weather radar and satellite. You can see spotty showers making their way across the area, even a little bit of mixing in the upper elevations of the Poconos. So we have that very cool air in place. We are looking at the NYX system that's really going to come at us for Friday and in, this is Friday afternoon and into Saturday, all day Saturday. Behind that, there's another system. But this one is going to be our big weather maker for the weekend. It's going to make you wish that we were somewhere perhaps uh, singing La Boheme in the Caribbean. <laughs> That's probably what you're going to wish for. Round one of this heavier rain arrives uh, later in the day on Friday and Friday evening. It will be rainy for much of Saturday indoor plans there. And then a second round develops late Sunday. And this could be as late as Sunday evening. Here we go. As we go into this afternoon, you can see some breaks in the cloud cover and still a passing sprinkle or shower. This activity picks up this evening. Could even see a thunder shower this evening. So your evening commute will maybe be a damp one, but it isn't going to be a big super soak. These spotty showers continue into very early tomorrow morning, but notice this the clouds give way to sunshine. Here we are at 1 o'clock, and we wind up turning sunny late in the day tomorrow. So, tomorrow, the pick day of the week. Now, we roll through tomorrow evening. Clouds rebuild for your Friday. You'll wake up to mainly cloudy skies on Friday morning, and then the rain is knocking on the door between about 2 and 4 o'clock in the afternoon. That starts to move into the area just in time for your Friday evening commute. Here's what it looks like for the next several days. An early morning shower tomorrow, Friday. This represents late in the day, the afternoon and evening. 90% chance there. 100% or an 80% chance on Saturday, but I think this will go up to 100%. On Sunday, this represents Sunday evening and into Monday. Monday lingers into early Tuesday. So this is your official umbrella alert for the next seven days. Again, tomorrow being the pick day. Here we go. Let's pick this up Friday afternoon, the big picture. Here we go. Friday night and into Saturday. There we are at midnight. Then we go into Saturday morning. We've got the rain ongoing. We have it Saturday afternoon. Even some lingering showers Saturday evening. Good thing is Sunday morning for the Broad Street run, you may see clouds. It may be misty, but it should be dry. We don't get that next batch of rain in until Sunday evening here. It is at 830 in the evening. That rolls through the area. That makes our Monday very super soaker soggy, and that lingers into our early Tuesday. So here's what we are looking at as far as temperature. 63 today, 67 tomorrow, pick day tomorrow, 61 on Friday afternoon and evening showers, super soaker Saturday, 65. It will be wet Sunday evening, but dry in the morning for the run. 62 on Monday, a damp day there, and 59 on Tuesday. So all below average temperatures and a whole lot of rain headed at us. Natasha? Okay, I'll keep the umbrella handy and the coat. Thank you. Thank